Good morning, Mai Tai. Oh, hi. Hey, girl. Hey, hey, hey girly, girly pop. pop. Welcome back to a new video. We're gonna get Starbucks first before we do this intro. What can I do for you? Can I get a chocolate croissant heated up? Then can I get a tall pink drink? And then a venti berry berry hibiscus? Thank you. <laughs> okay, so what are we doing today? Actually, I'll explain it. <laughs> Merch link in description. She does a series on her channel that's like the spending a thousand dollars to be an insta baddie, to be less ugly, stuff like that. And it's like another version of the transformation challenge. Which we both frequent on both of our channels. So I thought it would be kind of funny if we did spending a thousand dollars to be crazy rich Asians challenge. Because we're both Asian. Yeah. <laughs> This what? is gonna be hard to explain. We're not actually gonna try to look like the people from Crazy Rich Asians because that's, that's like a lot of money. It's way too hard, but we're gonna try to look like we're rich and then we're also Asian, so we're still Crazy Rich Asians if we can pull this off. Now, the issue is I looked up the price of designer bags because I asked you guys on Instagram, like I always do for these transformations, what rich people look like. Are you about to sneeze? And you guys said designer bags, so I was looking up designer bags and they all start at $1,000. So this chat. Oh my god! We might end up spending more money, but I'll probably return everything. Everything I got anyways, so can you don't return worry. Gucci? I remember I just it see. said online you can, but I don't know if in store you can. <laughs> I don't know. Gucci's a lot of money, okay? It is, and I would never justify spending that much on a purse. Okay, bye. We are going to go to Neiman Marcus and Nordstrom because they usually have the designer bags in there and we're just gonna see what we can get. We're probably not gonna get Gucci because they don't even have a Gucci store near me. The closest one they have is like an hour away because <laughs> I live in Bumfrick, Texas and they don't have Gucci here because no one could afford that. Gucci is overrated anyway. T. So you guys told me that I need to get a designer bag. I'm gonna wear a dress and heels, really big sunglasses like famous people wear and AirPods, AirPods obviously. <laughs> I'm very uncomfortable. No one thinks that we can afford anything because we can't afford anything and I'm very uncomfortable. We went to the Gucci store, which I didn't know they had in Neiman Marcus, and the lady definitely didn't think we could afford anything, which like, she's not wrong, but you know, content. And then we went into the Yves Saint Laurent store. Yeah. And the guy was so nice. He's like, have you guys seen our new collections? Like treating us like we could actually afford it. Just so kind. I very much appreciated that. But Yves Saint Laurent is way more expensive than I thought. Like there's a purse from Gucci that's 980, which, we can do for the video and hopefully return, but you but said the wrong was like 2500 Oh my god. Ooh, I've always wanted a duffel bag from here. A what? A duffel bag? Oh yeah. Where are we, Haley? Oh my gosh, you're getting content for me. We're in Nordstrom now. What are we looking for? Mm, I feel like Ariana is a good example of what Rich looks like, so like some really nice heels. I don't see any in here though. What is this, a picnic basket? Cory Birch. Cory, yes, Queen. <laughs> Go off. <laughs> this is so zoomed in. Do I look like Kim Kardashian? I don't do. take my picture. Four hundred dollars. <laughs> These are four hundred. Yeah. What? <laughs> I'm shocked. Really? Two hundred twenty. You look like a mom. I hate this lifestyle. I really don't like it. You can't even see my eyebrows. We might go to the Gucci store now and get the nine hundred eighty dollar purse because it would just be really good for this video, and that's kind of the point. So don't skip the ads. <laughs> I'm really stressed out. Okay, we're going back to the Gucci store. The lady did not expect us to buy anything, and I was like, okay, we'll come back. And she's probably like, yeah, that's a good excuse for not being able to afford it. So if we go back and actually buy it, she's probably gonna be shocked. But I don't know if my credit card will let me spend that much money on something so if it gets declined I'll be pretty embarrassed but we'll just see what happens we might just have to photoshop Gucci on it Basically. I'm not sure yet um this is really stressing me out I've never spent this much money at one time on a singular item and it's I don't even feel like I would ever wear it so it's kind of concerning if I can't return it I'm overall just very stressed out right now just ask them what's your return policy right when we're buying <laughs> everything about this is so embarrassing it's fine it's for the content are you ready why am I nervous <sighs> Okay, stop recording. They don't let you. Hi. Okay, so this one was 980, right? And then how much is this one? Um 1980. Oh, okay. Can I look at this one? Yeah. What do you think? I think it's cute. Adorable. Alright, can we get this one? Yeah. Haley's making her first beauty purchase. How much did you spend? <laughs> With taxes? I can't breathe very well right now. Why am I gonna start crying? This is so weird. <laughs> How much did you just spend? A thousand dollars. A thousand dollars? It was like a thousand a hundred. <laughs> oh, I don't know if you can return these. Dude. <laughs> she 
asked me if I wanted a wallet to go with it, and I was like, oh, so now you think I have money, okay. Oh my god, that's so funny. We found it, y'all. This oh. is it. <laughs> She's running so that nobody can rob her. <laughs> I really did not expect this to happen. So I went into this thinking, okay, well, mm, I don't know what I was thinking because the goal of this was to look like we're crazy rich Asians and it's kind of hypocritical because you have to spend money to look like that. So then you're kind of like, you're like less rich than when you started. So this challenge doesn't make any sort of sense. But when I asked you guys on Instagram what rich people wear- and Everyone like, said Gucci. Everyone said Gucci. I'm just gonna like put all the ones that said Gucci. So I was like, this video would really not just be yeah, it what would, you guys want mm, if we did not buy Gucci. I'm stressed because I two weeks ago I was sitting at this restaurant right here talking with my family giving my little cousin a talk about how Gucci is not cool and, and I was like trying to give him that lesson and here I am so I can never wear this around him and also I gave this whole speech about how I don't like people looking at me because I don't want them to like look at me and then think I have money because I don't want people to think I have money because that makes me feel uncomfortable so everything about this is so hypocritical and I'm aware of that but that is the point of these transformations is to make you look like someone that you are not so this is not me at all but that's the point but keep in mind you guys asked for this we're giving you guys the content that you guys want this is for the video we did not just go mm, let's just get a rodeo drive and get a gucci bag okay i'm gonna admit something that i never thought i would admit so i'd never really like looked at gucci stuff until this video and i went online to look at what they had and i got the cheapest bag they they possibly had which was <laughs> not very cheap but that was like their cheapest one and apparently it's really popular because it's like their cheapest one but it's also a handbag so people like it and i'm not gonna lie i looked up pictures of girls wearing it and it kind of does make your outfits look cute so now i'm really stressed because it's like is it bad if i wear it you know like is it i don't know i'm really just Kate. confused okay hi i'm editing this and i kind of have my thoughts composed and what i thought is i don't want to make it seem like everyone who has gucci is a bad person it's all about intentions right so if you're wearing it to make other people jealous or if you're wearing it to flex then that's gross obviously but if you worked hard for it you genuinely like fashion and you think it's cute then oh then obviously that's completely fine and you should be proud of your hard work and you should you can wear it whatever but i just don't ever want to be perceived like i'm trying to flex because that makes me feel actually disgusting so that is what i was trying to say this entire time so just i have my first therapy session in one hour and i'm probably going to talk about how stressed out i am about this <laughs> Okay, enough talking. We're gonna um, unbox this. I'm gonna unbox it for you. I can't believe I'm doing this on my channel. I actually can't believe it. Literally like six months ago, I would have laughed at this. Literally two weeks ago, I would have been Haley, like, no way I'm YouTube doing that. YouTube is changing you. Haley, you're changing. <sighs> I can't believe I'm holding this. Okay, let's do this. Okay, we're opening it. I don't own anything designer. Um, oh. Comes in this bag. I feel weird oh. touching it. I feel like I'm contaminating it. I know, I really feel odd right now. Okay. Like you're holding like a flight around the world in your hands right now. I know, there's like so many better things you I could have You were holding bought like people's rent in your hands. That, that's what's crazy to me. I really don't understand designer stuff. The only reason people buy this stuff is like to feel cool, which okay, I- but like, wouldn't it be cool? Okay, so I've like looked at like expensive shoes and stuff like that and I'm like, oh, I want this. But I'm like, my, would you rather show people that you have like a house or would you rather show people that you have shoes this is it this doesn't feel real this is really unnecessary and ridiculous i can't believe i'm even making this video my next video is gonna be a thrifting video <laughs> that's it's like kind of pink on the inside that's cute i mean it's so ugly i hate it uh this is it i'm not gonna lie i think it's cute with like dresses and stuff is it worth it no i would never actually buy it just for myself but this is um not gonna be taxable because it's for work so at least i get to write it off in my taxes that's the good part <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm stressed. I think this could be a headband. We also got huge sunglasses that we imagined. You know when famous people are walking around with these huge sunglasses and they just like, don't want to be seen. They're like, don't take pictures. Don't take pictures. Yeah. Yeah, so this is what these are supposed to be like. Okay, see you at home while we like beat our face, put on dresses and heels, put that stupid purse on, and then sunglasses and AirPods. Bye. About to go to therapy. Never been. I'll tell you what it's like on my vlog channel. I'll probably make an entire video about it. All right, guys. I went to therapy. <laughs> I had a panic attack, but that's for my vlog channel. To get on with this video, I'm going to go. Where are you? <laughs> for this video i'm gonna take a shower first because i'm just greasy and then we're gonna beat our face i'm gonna do a slick back bun because that makes you look pretty high rich ponytail. and then we're gonna show you the reveal of the outfit and like you know just try to look rich i guess like crazy rich Asians. i took a shower i feel much better now it's for my favorite time taking our face yes exactly <laughs> Okay, we're gonna go change into our dresses and do a little reveal, and then we're gonna add accessories and take a photo shoot. I'll do a peanut butter, baby. Hi. Hi. <laughs> I look like a mom.
mom and she looks like a teenager. Take off your silver no. jewelry. No. Your this does not look like a wet rich girl. It looks like a beach girl. <laughs> okay, time for the accessories. I feel like gold jewelry goes with this the best. Oh, that looks rich. I hate that word. Probably gonna cringe so hard when I edit this video. Sorry, I can't hear you over the sounds of my ear pods that are playing nothing. Your ear pods? Ear pods. And then I'm gonna put on this necklace. Rich people use perfume, right? I feel I like know. I see this in the movies. I never use perfume. <laughs> I look like a mother. Okay, outfits what are on. I can't believe I'm doing this. <laughs> Heck. It's so long. Here's this. Now for the sunglasses. I feel like I'm in the major. Jeez, we look. <laughs> oh my gosh. I've never looked like this in my life. <laughs> Holy crap. This is weird, dude. My gosh. Where would we ever go like this? Literally, where? The Met Gala. Oh, wait. There's one thing, just one thing that we are missing. Out with the old, in with the new. You know the shirt thing. You better. I'm sorry, I don't talk to Cleves anymore. Yeah! We've done it. <laughs> they look so stupid. Ew, we look gross. They make me look like I'm 30. <laughs> okay, so we did it, I guess. Now we take pictures. How disgusting this is. I hate this. I hate this. This makes me so uncomfortable. I can't even think of rich things to say. I don't want to post this video. This makes me feel like the point of these videos is that you're becoming something that you're not. Okay, remember that. Becoming something you are not. This not. Okay. That's enough for this video. If you also are envious of rich people, give this video a thumbs up. And if rich people make you uncomfortable, give this a thumbs up. You can subscribe to join the family. And oh also, yeah, my last name's fam. Go subscribe to my, if you want. You can go subscribe to her. You can also follow us on Instagram to see what this completed picture looks like. It's gonna be very disgusting. So go check to see if there's hate comments on it because there probably is. I also have a vlog channel and a Twitter and I post every fam Friday and sometimes on Wednesday. So turn on your post notifs. I'm gonna go back to my old ways in my next video. Can't wait for that. Okay, see you somewhere else on the internet. God bless, girly pops. <laughs>